Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, welcome. So I'm doing an updated skin, ugh, blooper, updated skincare routine, and as you can see, today's day, so I got my stars going here, and my hips here, and my little things on my face, but um, I haven't done a video for skincare in a while. I mean, these days I've been using... I have these erase your face wipes that I use first to remove my, you know, most of my face. And then I go in with my skin active micellar water, micellar cleansing water all in one. And to cleanse my face, uh, I just saw it a second ago. I should have had all my stuff together before I started filming, but whatever. Stay in there today, that's why I'm so early. Then I use my Garnier, Garnier Skin Active Professional Facial Cleanser made with aloe juice, which is for sensitive skin. I like the way that it feels on my face, it makes my skin feel like kind of smooth, like it breathes. And then I usually just go in with my Oil-A Cleanse Toner to make sure my face is nice and clean. And then I take my Garnier Skin Active Hydrating 3-in-1 Moisturizer. It's a day and night mask, but I only use it as a moisturizer. I don't really use it as a mask. And then... It depends on how I feel, like maybe once or twice a week, I'll use this Elemis Superfood Vital Veggie Mask, and it makes my face feel like really hydrated and refreshed, and I it on for 10 minutes, it kind of tingles a little bit, and then when you remove this, you want to use a dark cloth because other cloths will stain, and then when I'm alternating between my masks, uh, one second. I use this Wonder Beauty that I got in the box of Charm box and it's a lip buff purifying brightening peel off mask and this you only want to do it once or twice a week but lately I've only been doing it once a week and you leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes but you want to make sure you have an even layer so you can easily peel it off. I'm not using this one today so I don't feel like I'm going to have that camera yeah, so I'm just going to do this one. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so. Up. Oh. Alright, so I'm just going to wipe on this one. Suck on. Oh, and I forgot to say I've been using these Kirkland Signature Micellar Water Wipes. Because they're cheaper and I got them at Costco and I got them at Costco. Okay, get your paws. Go tell it's going to help you visit. Oh! I'm washing my face. No, I'm washing my face. Mama's washing her face. Hi. Hi. So I use these first. To do my eyes. Press it and hold it for a 
second. I'm like dab my fingers in there, press it in. Johnny, you cannot make him play the game if he doesn't want to play anymore. Stop it. You go play by yourself. Then you can turn it off. Okay, then I don't know. He doesn't have to play if he doesn't want to. How are you a four-year-old and you're trying to be the boss of a 12-year-old? 11. Okay, so now I got my wipey. Go ahead and remove the rest of the makeup and jewelry. Which I still have some of And I also like to use this for my eyelashes because usually it's like cotton pill. Cotton rails always get lit on my lashes and that kind of hurts. It'd be so hard to get it out of your eye because you can't see it because it'd be white on your eyeball. So that's why I like these. But I mean, they're not bad. I got like a whole pack of like 60. I think for like 19 bucks. Or 12 dollars $15.99, something like that. Why not buy a pack of 25 $5.99, $6.99. I figure why not? I don't have to keep buying every two weeks. So I have to use a bit of my eye and my water in. And my mascara. But I do go over the mascara with a towel too. But from BoxyCharm that I have yet to use because I'll be kind of nervous trying new stuff because I don't know if it's going to like break me out or whatever and I have some deep skin
up at luxury because I work at 6 o'clock in the morning. When I get off, work is 2.30. So I like to hold my eye like this to get as much as that foundation. I'm sorry, mascara off as I can. I did my coat and mascara. That's what happened when you don't put your clothes away after you wash them. It probably fell behind my dresser because matter of fact I had it on my dresser. So you pretty much just wipe it off. before and I didn't decide so I don't know why I told you to use a dark towel but that's what it says alright now I'm just gonna take my towel now I go in with my toner and see how clean my face really is I used to use sea breeze but I switched to this one because it's for oily skin. Yeah, when my son was in the hospital and I had on makeup, I had to wipe my face with a clean my face with a baby wipe. Make something's better than nothing, right? Mostly I have to go along my edges more because from contour stuff by my hairline is where I have most of the makeup. So there's three so far.
guys, I'm gonna open this thing, but it's hot. This is so good. And I just scratch myself. Routine. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate your support. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell if you never want to miss another video. I'll drop my social media in the description below.